While holding the control button of your keyboard, select both sensors to display the control panel's pairing tab. Enter the distance between the sensors in millimeters and select Apply. Now the sensors are configured for speed calculation. Remember to save the configuration by selecting the yellow Save button. Traffic Dock 2 will validate the changes, and by selecting Yes, will write the configuration to the access point's flash memory. Turn on Discover Mode to allow RF devices to send additional status information to Traffic Dock 2. Select the Map Layers button from the left side of the Traffic Dock 2 screen to show Map Configuration Display Options. Selecting the Controller Card Connections displays Sensor to Controller Card Input Configurations. These can be made by simply dragging the sensor icon from its sensor zone to a specific controller card input. Confirm by selecting the Yes button. Select Sensor Pairings to display Speed Sensor Pair Configurations. The arrow points in the direction from Lead to Trailing Sensor. Select RF Connections to display Radio Frequency Configurations between RF devices. As a final configuration step, from the Tools menu, select Auto Assign Time Slots. This prevents any potential communications conflicts between RF devices.